Hello everybody on YouTube, Sonic Waffles here, and today you are watching another episode of Sonic Sojourn. We're back here in the world of Sonic Sojourn, and I'm going to move my mic one moment. There we go, now I'm not so loud. And we are back here at the castle, and I haven't done anything, I, I just really haven't been inspired, so I don't really want to work on anything, but I remember last thing we did was reorganize that roof. I need to get some more spruce wood because I really don't like that roof. Here, I'll show you it real quickly. Um, it's uh, it's a good looking roof, I will say that. It is a good looking roof, but I, uh, here, let me get up here so you can see the little, see there's like a little hole in it. I don't know if you guys have seen this, but here it is. And we've, we've got, what, what do we have here? We've got stone brick, cobble, stone brick, cobble, stone brick with some trim. So we need a little bit more trim of birch wood, probably a ring of birch wood stairs or something like that, just to kind of, you know, spread it out a little bit. But it is looking really nice. So I think I'm going to leave it like that. But, ooh, I've got the rumbles. Uh, but I wanted to work over here a little bit today. This is our dungeon entrance. And do I have, I have feather falling. Man, I always got fed of falling. Um, but yeah, I've, I need to work on, uh, I need to work on this castle more, and I guess a good way to start off is doing something simple, something that I don't really have to work a whole lot on, and man, this inventory is a mess, so is this chest, and I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put all this in here, yeah, that's me, I'm just putting it all in there, and I think that should be good. We're gonna do something with iron bars and sticky pistons today, something uber, uber simple, and, uh, I think it'll look cool. So... First things first, you know, I'm going to even... Oh, well, how's I getting power? Ooh, I bet. You know what I bet? Hmm. I don't know what I bet. But let me just uh, real quickly see if you can pull and retract iron bars. Can you do that? Yeah, of course you can. Alright, so that will work just nice and dandy. Just wanted to double check to see if that worked. But um, it's going to be an easy project, so I'll just sleep real quick. And uh, I'm going to talk about something that uh, I really want to tell you guys. And, you know, I I really, you know, I say I appreciate you guys. And I think it's kind of gotten to a point that, you know, it's just saying, oh, it means something to me. Or I appreciate that is now just a pleasantry. It's just something like, oh, hey, how you doing? You know, that's just what people say when they meet each other and it doesn't really mean anything. It's not like I actually care how you're doing. And even though it's kind of a, you know, an, a sadistic way to look at it, we'll put the switch right... We need to hide it somewhere. Hmm. Somewhere a little bit hidden. Come on. Let's see. Uh, maybe... Uh, maybe, you know what we could do? Here, I got an idea. We will do something a little bit, I don't know, cheesy, maybe. Do I have a silk touch? I got a silk touch right here. I'm just going to take some leaves with the silk touch pick. I know it's a waste, but I've got a million. So, yeah, it's kind of gotten to the point where it's just like a pleasantry. It's like no one even believes me when I say it, even though I do. So I wanted to say something a little bit different. Um, you know, you guys, uh, I don't think you guys understand, like, I don't know, to me, words don't mean a whole lot. You know, I can brush off things pretty well. Oh, geez, this is, this is a terrible. Um, I can brush things off, you know, when people say stuff to me that's obviously not nice or whatever you want from me. It's not nice. Um, but when someone says something, you know, I got a really legit message from a guy who, um, I don't know, even know what I'm doing. You know what? Screw it. We're just going to put the lever somewhere else. But I got a really legit message the other day, and it really, it really kind of made me, now this is not going to do either really kind of made me a little bit uh, emotional just because, I mean, he was, I mean, a legit thinker and he put some effort into his little message. So he asked me to add him on PlayStation Network and I did. I mean, normally I ask people to add me because I'm really lazy. But he he hadn't sent it yet, but I sent it because he was a, I have the burps. Um, he was a really nice guy. So I did it and... Um, really nice things i it's it's amazing how no one does it anymore no one does you know 
nice things for other people. It just seems like, you know, I'm, I think about number one all the time. And the fact that when I'm on YouTube and if I make videos that someone actually likes, they're getting something out of it, so they feel more inclined to do that. Like, random act of kindness, really, if you leave a nice com comment, technically it's not a random act of kindness, because in general, you liked it because it gave you some advice, it gave you some, you know, some insight on a certain tactic, or, you know, this, that, or the other. In all honesty, normally, it doesn't mean that you... It doesn't really mean that you're being randomly nice. You just, you were nice, you know, you, but you did get a reward from it, you know, or hopefully you did. And because of that, you know, I, I get to see, and I, I don't I don't think that way, obviously. I still take a nice comment for a nice comment. But it's so weird seeing those nice comments because on a day-to-day -day basis, no one says nice things. It's just, oh, well, this is not going to do. Well, I guess it will work. You know what we could do? So we could put another stone brick right there, and right on this side we'll put another one in. Perfect. But on a day-to-day -day basis, you never hear anything. So when you hear, even on the internet, and you know that, well, the guy's really saying it because, you know, he got a little bit of, you know, something to reward or, you know, how to... You know, loop V sets to where you can get you know a bunch of V sets in a game, or you know whatever it may be. He got something out of it. It wasn't just you know random, completely random. Because you just don't see much kindness at all. Even something like that means quite a bit. It's um, it's kind of amazing. It's kind of amazing knowing that uh, that whatever I'm doing here, I don't. I mean. Whatever this is, it's making people be nice, which just blows my mind. People were nice because, I don't know, something I said, something I did in a video. Do I even need this? I don't know if I need that piece of redstone there. I think I do, though. No, I guess I don't. Um, yeah, but whatever I said, people are nicer because they heard it. And, or in general, that's the way I see things. Maybe I'm just, you know, talking stupid right now, but that's at least the way I feel, and I just wanted you guys to know that uh, when I see that, it fills me with great happiness that uh, you know, people are being nice to others. Um, not necessarily, you know, taking pride in the fact that, hey, he liked my videos, yay! Um, even though it's a good thing, and I do take pride in that, it's... A little bit even more of a sweeter feeling to know that someone someone is, you know, going out of the way to be kind to other people. And that's something that I just don't see a whole lot of today. So, you know, that's just what's been on my mind. I've been kind of thinking about that, which is something I like to do, but I don't, just don't I guess I don't do enough. But, um, yeah, it is unfortunate that people won't be nicer. But... Can't fix the world. Uh, I don't. I don't want to. Wait, wait. What is that Ozzy Osbourne song? I don't. No, 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 no. Not the Ozzy Osbourne. Well, maybe it is an Ozzy Osbourne song, song I'm thinking of. But there's this one song. Uh, I'd love to change the world by Ten Years After. It's a really good song. I played on the guitar. It's a beautiful song. And but yeah, yeah. I think this is a. Uh, Nice little commentary we had. Oh, man, I had I had sticky pistons right there. What was I thinking? All right, we've still got two bars, so, yeah, we got everything we need. So we'll continue this little stupid door idea. And it's just something simple, you know, something that I could work on. Adds a little bit of, I don't know, adds a little bit of something, a little bit of motion, a little bit of dynamics into the build, which is, Always good, and that's that's why you know what that's why I like about redstone, is that it is literally the blood, the thing that provides movement for Minecraft creations, which is absolutely awesome. Because most Minecraft creations are static; they don't move, they don't change, they are dead, and this really changes things. So. 
So this should push both out. Pushes one out. Um, let's see, how can we fix that? We'll just do a little simple loop around right there. Right there, boy. And do that. There we go. Nothing too complicated. I know I could have put a repeater in there, but I really don't feel like wasting it. And let's just put... We got a few things to put down. We got that up there. Uh, we'll put some... So put some stone brick there. I'm going to cut it up a little bit. So now we can close it. We can get through. Oh, I like how that like interlocks. Ooh, this is nice. And it goes in the dungeon, which is still not finished. All right, so I just... Uh, so let's just recap what we've done in the video. We just did a little simple door here. Nothing too spectacular at all. But, um, you know, I really want to get this done, but I just haven't felt motivated. Maybe my next break but spring break I'm going up to Ohio and visiting colleges well actually I'm visiting my family but on the over there or up there I'm in Tennessee so it's up there it's up north um but yeah I'm gonna visit Ohio University which I'm not looking forward to and I hate Ohio State and University of Cincinnati probably gonna go and visit one see you know who has the most medical college acceptance accepted students and stuff like that because I'm going into medicine yay and I'm a junior in high school and you need to get this done so I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of Sonic Sojourn let me get out over here so I can actually say the proper outro while looking pretty and, and nope don't, never mind never mind just ignore what I was rambling on about so I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of Sonic Sojourn, and as always, have a good one.